Today we're going to catch a secret very rare fish. Before doing anything, we need to get in the water and catch a fish. Not the greatest fish in the world, but I'll take it an easy $50. And since we have a quest for a mustard fish, we're going to catch a mustard fish because that's even more money and that's going to get us closer to our secret fish. Idiot sticks on board, $450. Which unlocked the next rod for $750, which we've already made. So we're going to do a little investigation here to find out where the rare fish are hiding. Well, the good news is I made $450. The bad news is I haven't found any rare fish yet and that thing keeps eating my other fish. We're gonna add a diving lure to our rod so it goes down quicker so we can see what's down there faster. Definitely also gonna catch that just to get it out of the way, easy money. And that little fish is $200. We're gonna take a little look around, we're starting to see some new creatures. Catching one however, probably not gonna be super easy. We're gonna swoop down and get our fish eaten. So first I need to remove this aggressive idiot. Sell it for $45, catch one of these gentle morons. Then use a gentle moron to try and catch one of the new rare fish which doesn't work but you'll see them swim by down over there. At this point I think I have to get lucky for one of them to actually come close enough to want to bite this thing so we're gonna need a boat. We can do that just by following the quest along catching very easy fish. And when the game asks for two mustard fish you give it to mustard fish. But also one of these because I don't think I've caught one of these yet, round fin. I might uh, have missed my opportunity to catch one of the new fish. The mustard fish quest is complete on to bigger better things two swoopers and I don't know which ones those are. Turns out they're the little purple fish that likes to do mushrooms, get in the boat. Oh, I finally got one of the new ones. He bit it. We're going to reel him in. This should be valuable. Rare baby bloop. $350. Get in the boat. One of many rare and interesting fish we're going to come across today. Okay, I've hooked a medium-sized grumper for $800. I'm actually going to turn that $800 into bigger bait because I cleared out enough of the fish down below that I was hoping I could get it down to the big orange guys below. But this might be a poorly conceived plan. Everything's always way too aggressive when you want it to be and not there we go this is what I needed this will be a nice bit of money and some experience the big happy orange moron $2,500 and I got another baby blue but it's being eaten alive by literally everything else $87 get back in there we gotta turn my $87 into something useful like this idiot $450 yeah I'll take that that's gonna unlock us the power rod for $10,000. It can cast a lot farther, so we're already out to the buoy. Uh, there's also another new fish right there. It's like a white version of the baby bloop. So I'm gonna want to go ahead and catch that. We're also gonna need a boat so we can get out there further for some better fishes. But we're gonna throw the big bait out there to hopefully catch or that big or that big thing. There is a lot of new big things down there that look terrifying. I want to catch them all, but we got a new blueberry fish. 900. Tempted at this point to cast that back in for some of the bigger fish, but I think we need a bigger hook to hook them by the size of them. Oh, I forgot about the super quest already. $200. And now we need a rod attachment, which is basically the game's way of saying, hi, you're doing it wrong. Our next quest is to buy a bomb, and who am I to argue? We're going to cast that thing straight into the water and scare that fish away. Next is to round fin, which should be something with the round fin, which is the uh, purple fish right below me. Unfortunately, I disfarmed them all because they're worth a bit of money. So let's go ahead and take a gamble. We're going to rocket this fish way out there and hopefully find something a little more interesting. There's also red version. We definitely cannot eat that yet. One day we'll catch that big idiot who I'm pretty sure we're going to need a big hook and giant bait for him. He's going to be really annoying for a while. I got an opportunity to finally catch a little gray fish. This is a snob fish. It's only $50, so take that snob. I don't even care if anything bites you. I just want you to get back in the ocean. Since I have a, a whatever fish on the line, we're going to use a rocket to go try and get one of the bigger fish. Where's the big green idiot? He was non-stop here a minute ago. He's just playing hard to get. Uh, I might have to throw off my casting timing. I feel like I'm just casting at the same time and always catching him in the same circle. Oh, he was so close there. And for all of our effort, we got one of these little things. I've given up on my dreams of catching a giant fish for a second. I wanted the extra round fin. That just gives us money and experience that we need for boats and stuff that's going to get us further. And the further we get, the easier it's going to be to catch the big idiots. I did in the meantime happen to catch another grape, otherwise known as a whatever baby blue. I'm going to sacrifice that for hopefully a much bigger fish. Oh, oh, we need bigger bait. That was the wrong size bait. Okay, after catching this mustard fish, we've unlocked the boat shop. So I just need $35,000 and then I'll actually be able to, uh, you know, get out there. So for now, we're going to cast the mustard fish back out and hopefully catch one of the big green dummies. And we did not. Oh, I did also manage to hook one of these things. It might start getting eaten or we might be able to just pull it in. I'm pretty sure this is worth a few dollars because it's very rare and surrounded by the guard. Queen's fish, 2,500. And these idiots are all very worried about where it went. So we're going to go ahead and just continue to catch these. I didn't mean to throw that one back, but they're wondering where the queen went. So good. They can sit there and wonder. I'm going to sell them. We're also massively going to depopulate the ocean this way, but I'm perfectly okay with that for a few bucks. And the last grape idiot is gone. Oh, oh, we got him. He bit. 
He's on. We don't need a huge hook, so this isn't even the biggest type of fish. It's a very big fish, but it's certainly not the biggest one we can find. Rare adult bloop, $5,800. Yeah, get in the boat. That gave us almost $20,000 already now. Buy one bomb. Okay, $200 well spent. Now what do we do? Throw it in the water and scare something? That's fine by me. Here, we're going to scare this big cluster of fish that annoys me. Now we're going to reel on this happy little fish and sell them. We need one snout fish. I have no idea what that is or where to find them. And since I've hooked another one of these guys, we're going to see if we can cast them down nice and deep so that we can get one of the big orange morons here. Either one of them will work. I just can't say no to $2,500. And we've unlocked the bait guard for $6,000, but that's money well spent. Now when we catch a junior moron and cast him into the water, small fish won't be able to steal this anymore. Only bigger fish, which is very helpful. Ooh, I caught this one. It looks so angry. It's being eaten alive by a bigger fish, but we got one quarter of this one at least. This is a legendary bloop, $4,500. It's worth that much even only for its head. Okay, I just got a grumper for $800. Instead of taking $800, I'm going to try and turn this into more. So if one of the really big fish wants to, well, that's okay, because this is what we're after. I'd even settle for that other weirdo even. I'll settle for any weirdo at this point. I just want like a crazy valuable, ooh, bite that, bite that. Oh, he's looking the wrong way. He was so close. That's okay. I've got time on my hands. I can sit through this until we get something amazing. Ooh, feeling good about this one. Got him. Not sure what this is. Was this the one I already caught or was it the green one? And <laughs> what a little baby tail he has. How does he even swim? Stupid bloop. Get in my boat. Common adult bloop, 12,500 easy dollars. Which means that if we catch one of these, that puts us within $500 of a boat. I'm not really sure what's going on here, why there's so many big weird fish right near the uh, shore like this, but I'm not going to complain. Managed to hook this weirdo since he was sitting there annoying me anyway. $8,400 for the common bloop. Which means I now have a boat, which means I can sail around and catch fish as I want. And that's just going to make it easier to navigate in and around some of these big fish like that. So I know where he is so I can catch him quite easily if I work my way up the bait. So I take one of you, turn it into one of you, ignoring the hat on the ground, and see if the big green idiot is still here somewhere. I do see him hanging out down there. Wait, wrong timing. This is why we can't have nice things. Can you bite it? There we go. Easiest one ever. Adult bloop, 5,800. But we're looking for the legendary bloop, the gigantic one that we can't even catch yet. So we got to keep working our way along. But for now, I absolutely will settle for these very aggressive morons who just want to jump right into my boat. $5,800, get in there. Okay, we're going to take a cast out at our max distance here to see what's hanging out. There's a lot of little baby bloops, $900 each. I'll take that all day long. Or not, we're going to cast that one back because I can't uh, do things right. I managed to hook the red rare fish out of all of those first try. $12,000, get in the boat. There's so many bloops out here. I can't take the boat out any further, but I can absolutely sit here and catch grapes all day long. But let's try a cast with a rocket from here. And we might be able to get a very rare medium sized fish or something new. Or just one of those. You know, the most basic fish of all. But let's go down and see what else is down here. Never mind, my thing got eaten. We're going to try that again with some medium sized bait. We haven't caught one of these yet. It's only a medium sized fish. But that doesn't mean it's not valuable. Garump, $5,000. We're going to go sell everything before I do something stupid. All the fish on board were worth $26,500. And even these pink legendary baby bloops are worth $3,200. And I'm pretty sure I don't need any hook at all to catch these. They're probably just a little bit harder to find, but they're often... Yeah, there's one right here, actually. Can you bite that? I was catching those bloops so quickly that I filled up my boat in like three seconds. And we made another $8,000 because of it. I caught another rare adult bloop, so he's going to go sort of in the boat. And we're once again going to cast out some biggest size bait to really hopefully catch something good. Oh, I'll take the blue one. Can the blue one come back? Blue fish? He's chasing another fish, isn't he? Big blue fish? If I hang out here, this... never mind. Ooh, we got the pink one. Oh, we caught one of these before and it got eaten. So we're going to pull it away from all the other dangerous fish. I wanted the other one, but legendary bloop for nine grand. I'll take that all day long. That's a lot of money. And because we caught that one, the other fish might be a little more, like, easy to get its attention now. So we're going to try and navigate past all the other morons down to big blue territory. And, uh... Nope. Oh, we got the pink one again. Where did these come from so quickly? I'll throw it in a boat. That's no problem. I mean, that's nine grand for like 30 seconds work. So we'll just keep stacking those up if we have to until we have what we need. And our current quest is for the snout fish, which hides in the caverns down below. We can't even get to the caverns down below yet. Okay, I just hooked Big Blue. I did a misclick and accidentally wasted a rocket, but that worked out because we got Big Blue. Common adult bloop, 12,500. I'm not going to risk misclicking this, so he's going to flail around all the way back to shore. Uh, we're up to $80,000 suddenly. Like, we almost have enough for the next boat, even. We definitely have enough for the next rod, which I um, actually didn't mean to buy. I just wanted to look at it. But we need to catch some of the rare fish that are worth a lot of experience and money. 
There is, for some reason, a lonely redfish sitting there. I'm not sure what its problem is. I don't think it's supposed to do that. I will, however, catch these all day long because these are worth like five grand. And a lot of experience. That actually moved the experience bar noticeably. I decided to try some deep sea trolling since I have some large bait on, so the only thing that can possibly bite would be something this big or bigger. I also need one of these and probably one of those. But I'll never say no to a $13,000 fish. So I can want to set, try that same strategy again, but this time with rocket assist, that way we can go as far out and deep as possible. Because there's still a lot of fish out there that we haven't seen yet. And there's these big things, the deep sea bloops. Oh, and this one. Yeah, that's the one we're after. Huge hook unlocked. Uh, so on the way down, we also got the orange fish too, who happened to bite us. We're trying to reel away from everyone else. But now we can have the huge hook so we can catch the big fish down below. $2,500. Is that worth it? Yeah, whatever, get in the boat. Ooh, I made have an opportunity to catch this as the legendary bloop below me is just sort of lurking out there scaring me. This has got to be worth a few bucks. 6500 get in the boat. Now nah, we're getting down to the dark water where all sorts of big creepy things lay. Ooh, I'll take one of you. Oh, my thing's too big. You can't bite something this big. Well, we can do a little exploring at least and see what we got going on down here. That's just going to tear my hook off. We did get a hat though. Cowboy cats get 75% off on all rocket purchases. Yeah, why not? Okay, I'm going to spend $5,000 on a huge hook and also some uh, a rocket because we have large bait anyway. Figured I might as well take the risk right now. There's also a whole bunch of different things down here I could potentially catch now. It's just a really expensive gamble to uh, use this hook like that. I don't want to catch that. I don't want to catch you. Oh, he eats live bait. I forgot about that part. So I've got to hook a large fish and then work my way all the way up. So I've got to turn this, I think, into a bigger fish. And then, are you a bigger fish? Do you want to bite me? Does someone want to bite me? Does, oh, that actually worked. I thought we needed a bigger fish. We did it. We got the legendary blue. Yeah, get up here, stupid. You're going to worry so much money. I can't believe I got him so soon. That was so lucky. $64,000. Uh, I'm not going to risk throwing him into the boat. I'm just going to bring him on back with us. The common mega bloop. We need to find the legendary mega bloop. But for $64,000, I won't say no. I'm also going to switch my hat to ball cap at this point. We have $110,000, so why wouldn't we? I just wanted to have an extra quest active. That way uh, we could have more fish to potentially catch that would get us more experience and money. I'm also going to buy some increased reel speed. That's just going to get fish in sooner and uh, make me maneuver better. Okay, since I have another one of these on, we're going to go ahead and apply another huge hook and cast this out. Probably should have used a rocket, but we'll see what we can catch with this. There definitely was something big that flashed by. I don't know if I got on recording, but there was something really big. I don't know what you are, so I don't know if I want you. You, I would take, I think. I don't know if this was a good idea. We sent $5,000 on this hook. Oh, we doubled our money. I was so scared about dropping it, I brought it all the way back to shore. Okay, $5,000 hook. Uh, whatever rocket, we're just going to cast right here where we'll hook onto one of you. Well, that's not worth it. We're going to need to turn you into something bigger like you. Perfect. Also, if you could direct me to where the legendary bloop is hiding, that would be great. Georgian, $11,000. We made a profit. Did not mean to hook this. There's also a glowing fish, but I guess we're going to settle for whatever this thing is. $1,200? You're not worth my time. You get back in there and turn yourself into something more useful. Then again, these green bloops are down there probably far enough to be worth some value. So yeah, you know what? You get, get, get over here. Bite me. There it is. I also don't need the giant hook to do this. I don't know why I keep buying those. That was a rare bloop, $6,000. There's also these little uh, skitter things right out here. And because my rail speed's so quick, it's actually really quick to grab them along the way. I just kind of dive into the mob of them. I missed that one, but you get the idea. Oh, and I can uh, unlock Sonar for $5,000. So now I can use my handy little mini map over here to see what kind of fish are in the neighborhood without having to physically see them. Oh, I got the red one out of there again, 6000 So now we're going to go way down deep again and settle for this one for a moment. But we're also going to look around way down here. There was something really big right there. These are all pretty average. There's something really big right there. There's the big glowy yitty, which would be great to catch. I got to get right down below me here. It's not a bloop, but it's got a lantern on its head, so I want it. Just got to avoid everything along the way. Okay, yeah, that's fine. I can actually take you. It is still $11,000, so we did make a bit of profit. Especially considering the whole boatload is worth twenty five grand. I managed to get my large bait all the way down to the bottom now, so we're just going to cruise around, hoping to find something that can actually eat. That would work. A large red bloop hiding in the dark. Oh, but good, instead of that, we're settling for a $400 mustard fish. Well, we're going to go ahead and send this one right back down. We do have a huge hook on, so if we can find the red bloop down there, we could actually hook it. Just need to be really careful to stay away from other idiots. Are you the red bloop? Can you bite me? What are you doing? What are you chasing? 
I would really, really like to catch that fish. Well, I was sitting here trying to figure out how to catch this. Uh, whatever this is, just wandered over. It's a fish without eyes, so we'll take this too. Old Cusper, 58,000. He just happened to swim on by and bite it. I'm pretty sure this by itself is a quite rare fish. But now I want that big red bloop. So I need to find a way to get this down to the bottom without catching any fish along the way and as you can see that's not going to be super easy to do plus I can't really reel at all while doing this otherwise I've come too shallow but I am in the area of what I need I need I need that fish to bite and wait what happened don't worry I can keep doing this all day long until I catch that idiot it's gonna get expensive quickly so I think in order to catch the big bloop I need to catch one of these glowing fish which are playing really really hard to get I even have the quest on the bottom catch one legendary mega bloop I'll get it eventually. Unlike this stupid worthless legendary regular blue. Okay, I finally got uh, the glowy fish on. Now I just need to find the big legendary blue who is somewhere in the neighborhood or at least was. Oh, I saw his tail. I was going to say he was very, very easy to find until right now. And now he's playing hard to get. He's also a little bit deeper than me. Okay, yeah, good. I was totally thinking I just wanted one of these. So what we can actually do for this is add a repel so that these are repelled from my line a little bit. Because it is... Didn't mean to do that. It is really, really exciting when you finally catch all the fish you need and you just need to find the big legendary bloop and one of those boring idiots decides to go ahead and take it all from you because in order just to get down there I've got to put on a $5,000 hook and navigate my way through the whole mess of idiots which is really really hard to do in itself and then getting down there close enough to a glowy fish is very hard in itself oh come on bite me do I have it bite me bite me wrong fish come on red one yeah 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 got him we did it we did it we caught him the legendary rare blue. What is it? The legendary mega bloop. $450,000. I'm not going to risk swinging this back into the water. We're going to swing him around in celebration until we get all the way back. Legendary mega bloop. He's so big he doesn't even fit on the screen anymore. Easy money. We're three quarters of the way to millionaire. That took way longer than I thought it would.